Hi, and welcome to another exciting episode of Mr. Marco Eats. On this exciting episode, I'll be trying a Lunchable. I'm at the Three Sisters Falls in uh, San Diego County. There we go. What's problem number one is it's supposed to be several slices of cheese because of the heat and backpacking in. It's become one large chunk. We're gonna try to dissect a slice here. Success. We're gonna put it on what I believe is some type of cracker. Just a cracker, standard cracker, and a sweaty piece of ham. Here we go. Wow. Surprisingly refreshing. You don't really taste the cheese. Oh, aftertaste of cheese. The uh, saltiness and sliminess of the ham, the crunchiness of the cracker, followed by the mushiness and the power of the cheddar. It actually worked really well, especially that I'm starving and it's in need of protein. Let's try another one to make sure. Cracker. The cheese is a bit of a problem. not pretty. I wouldn't suggest using this on a date, but when you're just hiking with family and friends, more than adequate. Second one. It was the same. Again, you get that the, the ham taste and the, the saltiness of the ham, a little bit of the slime because it's been carried in my backpack and all hot. The cracker is exquisite and crunchy. It stays crunchy the whole time. The cheese blends in with it and you get the hint of the cheese taste afterwards. Wow, for like two bucks, this is a steal for a, for a hiking protein pack. Does anyone want one? No? I'll take one. You'll take one. All right, cameraman. Requesting one. We go with the cheese. Always a bit of a drama here. Does it melt it together? Sorry, my hands are clean. I just washed them in the Three Sisters Falls. Really difficult getting this cheese. The more you get into it, that would be the one real knock on this, is that you end up with a chunk of cheese. A knife would have been up. I think I brought a knife. I brought my Leatherman. Here you go, cameraman. We're putting, we're, putting, we're putting the ham on the bottom. The bottom. Okay, me. Uh -huh, you're funny, dude. Hey, you're funny. No, 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 no. I don't think they know I'm shooting here, but it's cool. It's a public place. All right, this is this is just you can't really get the cheese at this point. It's a bit of a struggle. This is going to be too much cheese. So then, of course, you're going to be like, oh, the cheese tastes great. All right, here we go. You know, I'm playing through it. You can edit some of that out. I mean, yeah, I taste more cheese because I put more cheese on it. I don't think putting the cheese on top of the ham or under the ham makes a difference. I think putting three slices of cheese makes a difference. How many cheeses did you put on I can't tell because it's become a just a cob of cheese. What? Should I get in their picture? Sure. <laughs> Am I in it? Yeah? <laughs> you want me in it? You're not in it. Oh. <laughs> Do you want to be in I it? Try, I try to cut you out of it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Do you want the last one? It's just all cheese. Why don't you make a mega one for the last one? I want to see what's up there. I want to see do you have shoes on though? Or? Yeah, I feel like we can get it there. You gotta do cracker, ham, cracker. I'm gonna put shoes on. Oh, shoes. wow. Really? Really? No, why would yeah. you put, you like, have wait, to split wait, up the cheese? You can't, it's difficult. You have two pieces, yeah. Okay. And then you say another cracker. Yeah, ham. Are yeah. you recording me or it? You, both. Okay. Then we can have. All right, so this one is. You can do another one. You could do ham and cracker. You could do. What do you have left? Only one cracker. I, I think. I think. I think we're biting off more than we can okay. chew here. 
All right, no pun intended. All right, so we're getting cracker, ham, cheese, cracker, ham, cheese, cracker. And I'm gonna do it in one bite, Furious Pete style. Do you need water? Thank you. We're not sponsored. Use the water to finish it down. 30 seconds. That's not water. <laughs> Gatorade. That was what I was expecting. Wow. Whoa. Okay. So it wasn't water, and when you expect it to be water, and it's not. It's, it's shocking to the system so it just flushed out all flavor I was trying to like remember what it was gonna taste like but now all I have is the weird Gatorade flavor that I'm gonna say was some sort of cherry or grape glacier cherry glacier cherry wow not what I was expecting when you said you want some water wow all right going uh, three crackers three ham double cheese was uh, was actually quite delicious but you just the chew factor was just too much I, I couldn't could have choked on it, possibly. That was a, a choking hazard. But overall, for like less than two bucks or two bucks probably with tax, this is a little protein pack when you're hiking. Besides the, the cheese coagulating, you might want to bring a knife or just deal with the cheese coagulating. Um, it's, it's exquisite. An exquisite little protein pack. Well, sorry. Want some water? <laughs> We're not sponsored. Want some water? No. Or do I want some? Not sponsored Gatorade. Frost. Cherry flavor. Don't talk with your mouth. So, overall, price wise, uh, compactability, travel size wise, um, I would give this uh, probably a 10 out of 10, but the cheese coagulating really knocks it down to... I might have to give it an 8. I mean, you're going to say, wow, the cheese makes it lose two points? Yes, yes it does. So in my mind, I think it should be <laughs> two um, sections of cheese. They, I think they could do that without a problem. Or put almost layer ham and cheese together. Why they have to be separated, I don't know. Uh, 13 grams of protein, so this is going to get me back up that. Well, that concludes another exciting episode of Mr. Marco Eats from the Three Sisters Falls. Cordy B. Meow.